Hello guys, I hope you had an amazing week. You're watching Movie Review. I'm your host Kaniki and this show is sponsored by Nizam Plaki. Stay tuned. So guys, I'm not kutoka last year, all of those episodes I did from last year, this year it's not any different to what I'm like, like K-dramas, Hollywood, Nollywood, uh, anime animation all types of genres of movies but this year we're gonna dive in deeper into like directors awards they won like actors cinematography videography um best in editing just all the things that involve the film industry so on this episode i'll be talking about uh disconnect the wedding planner everything everywhere all at once pinocchio uh, house party i'll also be talking about me time and also strange world so stay tuned so i'll start with uh disconnect the wedding planner it's a kenyan movie and it was released this year 2023 and you can watch it on netflix and it was directed by david tosh Getwanga. so the movie starts with this guy called otis otis niplia like otis is girlfriend one two three four five six seven as in everywhere like when you're gonna girlfriend wa like from work from home from school from everywhere he meets he's just like a guy who loves women like but women are pretty so i kind of understand him but it's definitely wrong to cheat and have it all those women have catch feelings for you and you don't want any serious serious thing with him so like otis is in this like let, let's say like a car restaurant or where like women that chill mkule have ice cream or like dessert with your friend or with your like romantic partner or anything and the girl like what boy another ni kidana me catch feelings once a day tell kwa then into serious but otis who is otis otis will play with you then leave you as if nothing happened then the fact that he was flirting with another girl while he was having his date there tells you everything so otis niplia tunanzi hapo but otis pia akona like this cute little daughter when you're co parent with another like lady so ni baby mama pia akona na don't you forget i said he has a lot of women in his life so and now on like a family business with like, his brother and like they are managing it and everything and like aka your nene simu na one of his like important investor mwenye alikuwa anataka ku invest in their company because the the company was like running low like likuwa na bankrupt so he, they need investors to make their company like proceed or be bigger or whatever so like the, he's a nigerian he calls this oga and tells him no 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 so you can invest in my company nini nini the oga refused but then akasikia like uh the fiance of the oga saying he she doesn't like how many this other wedding planner so i'll quote like, like ku pang your wedding a yoruba wedding which i would love to attend by the way i don't know how it happens but it seems to be amazing and fun so aka scale like the wife akisa man anaweza taka ku fanywa like an event planner mwenye naza make sure the yoruba wedding will be amazing cuz you don't get married twice okay you can but say like the first time you're going to do it it's going to be eventful for your life like you feel like most women like dream of getting married but you know all that time kind of thing so this akasama ataza ku handle hiyo nini um event planning thing and everything so i can pay your job i got my do kwake so when Otis was trying to like look for a company where where they can like set up I mean, like a company where it deals with event planning or like just event planner events with Kamaizo aka aka be do he was scammed by this lady who in fact he slept with so i think it was kind of his fault because if he didn't hook up with this lady hanging be do but then he hooked up with the lady pesas gapotea so that is kind of his fault so he has a, like a group of friends when you want anini or they like stick by him those kind of friends you can call when you don't have money you can call to like always have your back so it's kind of like on your friend group but peer e friend group like kill them to and do their other people's business then like you find they all have like a certain let's say a romantic situationship um, i don't even say romantic but it's kind of a situation ship never even like friends but then this one has dated this one or um, this one has slept with this one this one has done this like that, that kind of friend group but also like they stick with each other so on in mombasa like who host this whole like uh, wedding planning event and everything then they meet with this tanzanian lady who's the one of the house when you're in akupanga uh otis who's the main character and uh, he's in love with like tk who's one of the friend groups like boss lady and everything kuna in the friend group kuna this certain couple when you like they are 
wakona issues too zao and a therapy which is good like to have therapy if you think if you feel things are not working out kuna this other girl ali dampiwa na boyfriend yake no kuna this other guy who's single like all types of like friend in that ka friend group ako kwa hiyo nini hiyo nini yo event planning so they plan the event well otis ali sema jo ku panga yoruba wedding which of course he lied but I'll, i think i'll have done the same you have nyonenanga interview wala danganyo na zafanya hizi skills but you go and learn on the job this is the same case but after akina akina ogawa fike kuangalia when you didn't mepangwa no it wasn't the yoruba wedding that he had like waited for ma imagine that otis had done so kwa kuna like fast and everything but na pana the two girls were going to go and when you na pana tea like always wanting to like do look for look after this 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 and that but i really love this movie na pana vanye kenyan movies ama kenyan films they are they're bold they're becoming more bold more like creative they're not afraid to do this sort of type of thing to do this type of scenes i just love it it's just amazing and the fact that david josh getonga is a known director you definitely know this is going to be an amazing movie and the actors in this it was just amazing and again like i said napenda vanye kenyan on a promote kenyan music uh, like uh, places una pata novels vitu kama hizo i just love everything about it and iko on netflix like i said mwanda mwi watch i highly recommend it naipe an 8 out of 10 So on the next movie I'm going to be doing in Aitwa in Aitwa everything everywhere all at once. So this movie was released in 2022 and it was directed by David Kwan. So this movie starts with this immigrant Chinese lady who also she gets pulled into one and like kuna all these mixed up emotions and reactions. So imagine you just someone comes to you and tells you like there are other different versions of yourself just somewhere out there in the universe and everything. Of course you get shocked and up in a movie long like so because it's it, it's also a matter of science fiction and like science. You'll never know that they're the bad person. They're just amazing in, in every way in the acting skills, the CGI, the visuals. I just love the whole movie. It was like kind of uh confusing at some point but it was i just loved it and i highly recommend it i give it a 9 out of 10 So the next movie I'll be doing is called Pinocchio. I think me grow up in Kijua Pinocchio when the boy who, the wooden boy who when he lies his nose just grows taller and taller. I really hope we kwanga even like in real life when a guy lies to you that you're the only girl. I really hoped in kwanga you but it's not the case. You never know. Like if if the chitu the chitu at like you'll never know. But some people leave traces so there's also that but also let me go back to this movie and it was uh Pinocchio is about this wooden boy who comes back to life so Gepetto master Gepetto he had a son called Carlo and Carlo was well his boy then he died so cuz he was grieving that he needed his son he cried out for help was saying why like simrudisham to wangu then like he built a wooden boy then he came back he came to life the wooden boy came back to life but he called him Pinocchio oh I forgot to mention sorry that this movie was released in 2022 and it was directed by Guillermo del Toro yeah So this movie revolves ar- around uh Pinocchio trying to be a real boy trying to please his own father to be like Carlo and all his adventures that he did to make his father proud the way Gepetto like was like you need to love someone if they are your family the way they are and just accept them and embrace them in every single way I also love the cricket that spoke his fluent English and everything he's like an author and writer who documented the whole story about uh Pinocchio I love the way they portrayed the afterlife and everything I just love everything in this movie and also i forgot to mention it's a stop motion so like stop motion meaning like they take pictures of each like individual thing let's say this 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 katoy here so they take pictures of it moving and doing certain things so that it can show that it has motion it has life it can breathe it can do this it's like an actual human so imagine all those pictures that were taken to make this pinocchio it's just amazing i loved the plot line i loved the story and i just loved everything about this movie i love the acting skills of those toys could the way they moved then then they they like only funny can real so i really loved it and guys it's on netflix you should watch it i highly recommend it i give it an 8 out of 10 and with that we'll go on a short commercial break we'll be right back So 
so earlier I had talked about everything everywhere all at once Pinocchio and also talked about disconnect the wedding plan and now I'm going to dive into house party house party was directed by Calmatic and it was released in 2022 and the genre is black comedy let me just put it black comedy but it's mostly comedy and I love this movie DC something but I really loved this movie that they put all the the celebrities here there's also LeBron who's like the main kind of revolving around him and everything but in house one day unapata like who are McLean and everything with their friend Damon and Kevin but then they were called or uh, by one of the representative Munyakoko Kambio to call like fired and the, the fact that we were told they're going to be fired at Waka Jambia like let's just do this one job get the money and just to keep it private because of the our uh, paparazzi na vitu kama hizo so wanafanya party uko they organized everything they did this and that but then that's where things went down hmm una party they unajua wale tu mahomies when you know how to like so tight and so close i just love that and also napena like the blackness in this whole movie was like unapata like there's some sayings i'm the slang that talking about when I do to, yeah this is an american black american human being black american man woman child everything so napena to you because unajua to vizuri black people are funny yeah they're just they're just amazing in this movie they were they're just they're just amazing people and napena the fact that wali nini wali eka like i don't know if you remember this guy called seven out of ten and you guys should go and watch it muniambia like ni masula bongine wagani muliona hapo kuzi nezo kwa like siku nutu sengine so guys muniambia kwa comments mwenye muliona na mwenye amkuwa na makuka kuna mwenye ote niliko me miss out So the next movie we'll be doing it on me time and it was directed by John Hamburg and it was released in 2022 and guess who the main character is Kevin Hart so unajua tu mkiona Kevin Hart mahali mnajua tu ni pure comedy amazing comedy na also nani mwingine Regina Hall so the main characters in like this whole movie in this movie there are like a couple Sony Fisher ni mwenye like uh, Kevin Hart and then sister the wife unapata the wife ni architect so she's not like mostly at home but then napenda tu the fact that Wally Kasani who's Kevin Hart like a uh, uh, a take care of the kids like walikuwa na cop okay i want to say co-parenting but they were helping each other out look after the children like nana lisema kila sides women who's supposed to take care of kids no no if like the if a woman is, or your wife is making like six figures kuendelea ma eight or whatever na wewe kwa hapo unaweza take care of the children yeah, she will pay for everything and wewe utakuwa hapo unasaidia cuz also taking care of kids is a tough job na mimi na like i'll salute all mothers for doing that work you're doing an amazing job wherever you are mothers So na pena the fact that Kevin Kevin Hart akwa stay, stay at home dad na Regina Hall akwa like uh, the mother who goes out to make money and bring back nini money kulipa bills and everything and also na pena venye kulikuwa na comedy kwa hii na pena relationship walikuwa na like uh, his kids and him na pena venye the other kind the mama alikuwa busy she was trying to like connect with her children then as she worked too hard as a how to wow na pena to your relationship yote i love the comedy in this i just love the acting skill it's like in nikaina kwa nga so natural for kevin hart to act some like ni ni characters like it's like it's just him nika kuita msimu mwambie be yourself cause mimi napenda tu venye na act in all these like funny ama comedic movies i just love everything about it napenda venye alikuwa me karibu uliwe na this mountain lion but he survived but you know i just loved everything about this na he is the type of friend mwenye ko introverted then he has his other friend ito hack mwenye ko extroverted so unajua kuna bishte mwenye na hata karibu pass out he's still telling you hapana kunywa wengine tushoke tunaye tufanye hivi is kind of the same relationship i also loved that i really mean upon to your blackness na your movie na when you kuna like connection in this like people when you i just loved it honestly i just loved it and i give it a 7 out of 10 Strange World. Strange World was released in 2022 and it was directed by Don Hall. It starts with the Clades. The Clades are a legendary family where like so no many families and is nakuanga like uyu ni baba si juu nani alikuanga nani si juu mtoto wake amekuwa nani like that type of family where your name will continue living on and on and on and on and on. So na pata this movie starts with the Clades um uh, who was on an adventure with a Yega Clade who's like the grandfather of Ethan Clade and also such a Clade. So alikuwa ameenda kufanya like um 
like who research to like going outside doing this doing that like who discover new worlds he's like an explorer so he's going to look for different things you can see like your three like when I ku other worlds doing this doing that so now but like such he was not that kind of kid but also for his dad wanted to like force him into like being an explorer but he was a farmer so to na to na pata kuna like the relationship between Yega and Sacha cuz he was trying to force his kid to do this but yeah kuna taka hivyo then the dad akwata ku acknowledge the fact that no like his son cannot be like him so he didn't he didn't want to acknowledge the fact that they cannot be the same person so na pana nilipenda like when you look on your relationship when you grow from them not like really liking each other but becoming good friends and close friends pana pia when you Ethan like like I, what i know is like you're allowed to love anyone you want to love like love is love like you're allowed to do that and also kuna pata nini the wife of Sacha like she's this outgoing kind of like lady uh, a wife a mother who's like uh, comfortable who does this and that like napana napana a movie then the fuck your animation like one amazing visuals so like one cut to just amazing like one penda nili penda the storyline nili penda like like when you like to ilikuwa tu an amazing thing nili penda the theme song cuz unajua like animations zote lazima ziko na like a certain theme song na pana vya lena ku like explore this like certain let's call it a planet planet pando aka place a living thing so na pana vya lena shine nature also a living thing I, i really loved that i loved the dog cuz i'm a dog person also love this certain thing kablu thingy uh, ethan called splat can you call it fun although she, he or she didn't speak i just thought she was that, that was a tiny little funny thing called splat so i really loved the movie honestly i just loved it and I I highly recommend it and they give it a 7 out of 10. And with that guys don't forget to be interactive in the show don't forget to comment follow like share subscribe everything tell me the next movies is in your like review and everything and follow us at all follow us at all our social media platforms at nizamplakee bye